My sweet mama put her sparkly suit on yesterday, very peacefully. My sisters were both there holding her hand, and they told her it was okay to leave, and she just looked up at one of my sisters, closed her eyes, and off she went. The surprising thing about this is how I feel today. I'd anticipated that I would just get into a prenatal ball, stay there, and that did not happen. I realized that I've been in the grieving process since she entered hospice in early October. I was holding it in my chest, in my heart area, in my throat, and especially in my hips and my low back. I read up on that, and that's where many hold grief and stress. And you know what? I woke up today, I got out of bed pain-free. That amazed me. It's so much harder for us on this side to let go. Oh, I put my life pretty much on hold. I've, I've started and then had to stop because I couldn't focus or concentrate. And it's amazing that today I feel inspired and, and I want to go forward. I want to go forward for my mama. She's not out there somewhere. She's right here with me. And this I know. This I know. If you haven't seen the video yet that I posted last week about my mama calling me her very last time and telling me what I was wearing, remote viewed me. Go listen to that video. I've linked it in the uh, description. It's pretty powerful. And I hope that it will give you hope too that we're never really apart from anyone that we lose. We hold them in every fiber of our being. It's snowing outside. It's so gentle and peaceful. And that's how I feel today. I want to thank every one of you for holding my hand, sitting with me, and holding space for me during this time. I appreciate you so much. I have recorded her voice. I do have that. I have a gajillion pictures, and most of them are right up here. I have been loved unconditionally. What a gift. And that love will never end. I love you, Mama. Nothing, nothing will ever change that. And nothing will ever, ever diminish or change the love that you have for me and our family. That's eternal. Oh. Thank you, everyone. I think I'm going to be okay. I know I am. I know I am. That's the best gift I could give her. Hmm.